away from its roots as a martial art and has become too competition oriented. Jalen, you want to handle this one? We never watch judo anyway. I'm a big time fan, but at the end of the day, judo is not something we flick through the channel and watch. That is a hell of an answer, Jalen. I didn't know you were going to come with anything. What if you got your cool like guys good? Uh, this one might be easier answer, you never know. Uh, what should the Red Sox do with Schilling when they make the postseason? Because to tell you the truth, he looks like, what is that, uh, sign, star, percentage, ampersand, okay, I get it. I'm sick of uh, people saying that he looks better every start, right? It's Tim. And finally, Matthew writes, realistically, that the Giants have a chance of making the playoffs. Do you think the return of Barry Bonds can lift them to the next level and pass the Padres, Dibs? No, but it's great to watch Barry Bonds. Every time he takes the plate, you got to watch it. Of course. And in fact, uh, Barry and the Giants continue their chase of San Diego. On the East Coast, though, with a stop in Washington, D.C. on Tuesday, it's Barry's first road game of 05, so how's he going to handle the booze? He says, booze, you're supposed to boo me. Shoot, they ain't mad at you. They like you, man. They're, they're supposed to boo you because I'm good. That's why. I'm coming to get them. I don't care. Bring it on, baby. You're supposed to boo. It's all good. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the louder they boo, the more respect they have exactly. for you. Exactly. And, and that's how you're supposed to respond to when people boo you. Not like Rafael, Pome uh, Rafael Pomero who puts earplugs yeah. in his ears so he can't hear the boos. I mean, that's, it should that's motivate a superstar. You. It should motivate you, absolutely. But do you think they're booing him because he's still great, or are they booing him because of the whole steroids issue? They're booing him, period. This, but at the end of the day, he's going to go out there and hit his home runs and limp around the bases. I mean, he was limping after yeah, he hit yeah. his last home run, so he's a soldier to be out yeah. there. So, Were you a booer? Did you boo people? No, I don't boo people. Uh, occasionally. Occasionally I did. I, I did, actually. I used to boo the Pistons when they came in town, when the Cavs were good in the late 80s, early 90s. But for the most part, I didn't boo guys that played on my teams. I love when people booed me. Really? Totally motivated. I'm going to stick it to your team now. So really? Go ahead and boo me yeah, louder. Make yep, concentrate. Absolutely. Some, yeah, you absolutely. play so many games in sports, sometimes you need something to get you into the game. And it's nothing like looking in the stands and somebody trying to get on you. So every time you... You make a play, you, you point right at that guy. Nothing's better than somebody, somebody pouring a beer on you or spitting on you or something. Well, <laughs> like let's not go too far, Dips. I loved it. <laughs> you had people you spit at you? Many spit at you? Are you kidding, Chris? You huh? forget how people treated me. I loved it every second. <laughs> <laughs> he was a nasty boy. That's why. Yeah. I loved it. Why? I because loved you it. were opinionated. Right. And so we want you to be opinionated as well. Uh, just log on to FoxSports.com. Keyword, best damn, or send us an email there, best damn at foxsports.net. We'll read it on the air if it's any good, okay? And that way you can get the dibs all mad at you. All right, coming up, we'll get you set for Tuesday's show, which includes this beauty and plenty of beasts details ahead. But first, we'll tell you how best damn may help this former champion reclaim the belt. That's next.
James Tony, Michael Moore, Reddick Bowe, former champions stepping back into the spotlight on Best Damn. And now, next into the ring, September 30th, former light heavyweight champion, the road warrior, Glenn Johnson. He stood toe to toe with the best in the sport, Antonio Tarver, Roy Jones Jr. September 30th, Glenn Johnson takes on George Khalid Jones and continues his journey back to the light heavyweight belt. One more for the road warrior, September 30th. Live only on the Best Damn Sports Show, period. Coming up, a preview of our Super Tuesday. Plenty of muscle to cover every NFL angle. We got all the tough guys you'd ever want to see. But we also have a sensitive side. That's why this show is about the ladies. We'll unveil tomorrow's guest list next. Great guest list coming your way on Tuesday. Michael Strahan will join us tonight after they play the New Orleans Saints. Plus, four-time Super Bowl champion Bill Romanowski in studio. And look who else. Jenny McCarthy hosts a party at the home. As always, we love seeing her as well. Jayla Rose, great start once again, bro. We'll see you the rest of the week and uh, talk to you a little bit about your NBA future and a bunch of other things. All right. Some judo guys will be in tomorrow. I'll talk to you. <laughs> nice. you judo fans, don't kick my ass when you see me. <laughs> Thank you. All right, get in here. Guys, we will see you on Tuesday right here, 1030 on Best Stand. Yeah.